a chapter a day to brighten your way. My splendor comes from the grace of Jesus. Hello friends, let us read the Bible together. Today we'll be reading Zechariah chapter 3. In this chapter, God will use Joshua's experience to foreshadow the Messiah's salvation. Joshua was also called Jeshua in the book of Ezra and served as the high priest after the people of Judah returned from exile, so he was different from the one in the book of Joshua. In this vision, the high priest Joshua will stand in judgment on behalf of all the sinful people. What will be the final outcome of this trial? Let's read chapter 3 together. Zechariah chapter 3 then he showed me Joshua the high priest standing before the angel of the Lord, and Satan standing at his right hand to accuse him. And the Lord said to Satan, The Lord rebuke you, O Satan. The Lord who has chosen Jerusalem rebuke you. Is not this a brand plucked from the fire? Now Joshua was standing before the angel, clothed with filthy garments. And the angel said to those who were standing before him, Remove the filthy garments from him. And to him he said, Behold, I have taken your iniquity away from you, and I will clothe you with pure vestments. And I said, Let them put a clean turban on his head. So they put a clean turban on his head and clothed him with garments, and the angel of the Lord was standing by. And the angel of the Lord solemnly assured Joshua, Thus says the Lord of hosts, if you will walk in my ways and keep my charge, then you shall rule my house and have charge of my courts, and I will give you the right of access among those who are standing here. Hear now, O Joshua the high priest, you and your friends who sit before you, for they are men who are a sign. Behold, I will bring my servant the branch. For behold, on the stone that I have set before Joshua, on a single stone with seven eyes, I will engrave its inscription, declares the Lord of hosts, and I will remove the iniquity of this land in a single day. In that day, declares the Lord of hosts, every one of you will invite his neighbor to come under his vine and under his fig tree. In the vision, the angel said to those who stood before him, Remove the filthy garments from him. To Joshua he said, Behold, I have taken your iniquity away from you, and I will clothe you with pure vestments. Dear friends, just like Joshua, you cannot free yourself from sin and Satan's accusation on your own, but you have Jesus by your side. His salvation and his power will remove your filthiness and clothe you in splendor. Let's give the highest praise to Jesus today. There is no love in this world that can surpass what He has done for us. Let's pray. Dear Jesus, I praise You for You are the Savior full of grace, and I thank You for Your unconditional love. I will praise You all the days of my life. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. A chapter a day to brighten your way. See you tomorrow. Jesus loves you, and I love you too.